They all came in uh, after being there for eight years, so I understood the team environment pretty well, and you know we'd been really successful. Uh, so I wanted to have something that would uh, move people's backsides from the back of the seat to the front, and and something that was a little audacious, but something worth striving for. And I thought we were capable of doing it, and that was to be the most dominant team and. Uh, you know, in the history of the game in the world. And uh, you know, we had to do that by having a, a style of game that both inspired and invited us to be excited by it. When I spoke to the rugby union during my interview, I talked about both the vision and, and my guiding principles, which were going to be non-negotiable. Um, and, and there were six of those. Uh, first one was team would always come first. And whilst we, we would always care and have empathy for the individual, uh, the decisions that had to be made uh, had to be made for the betterment of the team. Now, after that, had to get our game right, uh, the type of game we wanted to play, get it right and, and keep evolving it and keep staying in front with our game. Uh, then it was about getting alignment on those things amongst the coaches. Um, and then after that it was about uh, getting that alignment right throughout the management and then taking that alignment into the leaders. I'm very fortunate through my time uh, to have some wonderful support uh, in that area, uh, some wonderful, wonderful people who really made my job pretty easy, uh, to be honest. After that it was about getting those people to drive it, you know, the players driving the whole thing and owning the team and having them at the front of the bus, so to speak, and, and the management at the back of it. So it was the players' team and uh, made them want to own it and take responsibility for it. And then lastly, I believe and we believed that if we got that balance right, simulation, learning and enjoyment and fun happening on a, on a um, level platform, then uh, we would get a performance come Saturday. Um, look, I think that'll be for other people to say, uh, but personally, uh, you know, I, I reflect on, have reflected a little bit, not too much um, yet, but I will do, I guess, over time. And uh, will we a dominant team? Well, you know, I think the records will show we were. Did we play a good style of footy? Yep, I think we did. Uh, there was times when we we didn't get the results we wanted, but uh, I think the style of game was pretty good. And um, you know. Did, did we have a team full of people who were prepared to give to the team? Yes, I think we did. The individuals uh, put the team first uh, all the time and um, you know, I felt like we had alignment with the coaches and, and, and the players and you know, certainly had players driving it. Uh, and the environment was definitely about having a bit of fun as well as learning. So, yeah, I think we managed it.